PLC Network here at CES 2026, and we're at the Creality booth here standing with Duke, who's got some interesting stuff behind us that we get to talk about today, which is exciting, but it's coming from a company that has a long-standing record of being part of one of the leading names in the 3D printing industry. And uh, pretty much if you 3D print, you know who Creality is. There's no avoiding that. And you probably might even have owned or own one currently. So. We have some new things behind us here, like I said, we get to talk about today. And Duke, it's a pleasure to talk to you today about this. Pleasure to meet and you. This has been great to be able to run into Creality once again. And uh, we've done a lot of work with Creality over the years. We've done a lot of everything from uh, some really great one-on-one uh, -on -one interviews, a lot of great reviews, a lot of just, uh, just good content through yeah. and through. And so it's not surprising to see that what we get to talk about today is really, we'll say, innovative but also affordable, which are two words that are not always, you know, something you find together. It's something that's exciting and we're seeing more and more in the 3D printing industry. And what do we have to start off with, with the 3D printer behind us? Well, thank you very much for that excellent introduction. Now, in terms of what you touched on there, innovative and affordable, those are not terms that go hand in hand most of the time. But we here at Creality are pushing the boundaries of innovation and affordability. And you said we've been around for a bit, right? 12 years, so about 12 years, that's, that's over a decade. I think that's a pretty good uh, foundation within not only the 3D printing industry, but we've expanded. And speaking of expansion, we are looking at an expanded brand powered by Creality. The Spark X is Creality's newest line of affordable 3D printers. This machine here is affordable, it's accessible, it's easy to use, and it makes one a hell of a desktop item. The Spark X takes what we've learned over the past 12 years, which is 3D printers can be difficult to use, you gotta tinker with them, you have to go on forums, you have to troubleshoot, you have to do all of these little things. When you wanna make a project, the printer ends up being the project. Well, guess what? That's not the case anymore. The Spark X is our introduction to the introduction of 3D printing. This device here features a 265 nearly cube build volume. It features a phenomenal status RGB LED strip just at the bottom. Not only tells you your status, you've got rainbow effects, you've got customized color effects. So for all you ROG enthusiasts and PC Master Race users, this is the machine for you. It's gonna look gorgeous beside your desktop master build. Not only do we have the 3D printer, but we've also got the introduction of our CFS Lite. CFS is Creality's filament system. This device here is capable of supporting up to four colors of filament, all feeding directly to the nozzle of the Spark X i7. i7 being the flagship product within the Spark X series. Now, when we're talking about ease of access and you know ease of use the word that comes up the most is AI 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 that's the buzzword right everybody of wants course. AI well guess of what we've got AI features packed into this that makes it even more easy to use a lot of people talk about how difficult it is to get into 3d printing and then you're throwing in multicolor well, this is the easiest way to get started with not only a 3D printer, but a multicolor 3D printer. Packed with AI features to be able to reduce waste for multicolor prints. Everybody talks about the poop that comes out of these machines. That's purged filament for, for people just getting into the industry. So we've got 50% reduction in the purged filament. Less waste of plastic and less waste of those dollars which are so hard to come by these days, right? The AI features included in the Spark X i7 are intelligent remote monitoring. So the Spark X i7 is fully remote control and print send, fully capable of monitoring through its little AI camera over here. The AI camera will not only monitor your 3D prints remotely, but it will also give you the ability to notice and be essentially aware of any potential failures. Accidents happen, failures happen. 
that camera will notify our users if there's any spaghetti or if there's an issue at all within your print. This is the ultimate creative powerhouse and the ultimate spark to your imagination. That is fantastic. And then not a surprise to see this coming from Creality. And it of course was Creality's next step because this is where everybody's moving toward. This you is, know this is where everybody's moving toward, but Creality's not just gonna stop at a 3D printer. We've got people wanting more and more. We've got people wanting faster machines. We've got them wanting certain features in our 3D printers. But Creality is not just a 3D printer company, in my opinion. We are a maker ecosystem. And speaking of ecosystem, as far as our 3D printers go, people will ask us, where do I get the blueprint? Where do I get the files? Can I just throw a picture in? That's where our Creality Cloud and our new app Flowprint come. You can take a picture, upload it, and out will come miniature figurines. You can do keychains. You can do magnets, you can do all sorts of things. We have this that comes from our Make Now software. Upload a picture and print a little character of yourself. It's just that easy. We've got tons and tons of examples. I mean, that's pretty close. You take the hat off. That's pretty close, right? So Creality also has the AI software, but in terms of hardware, we know that 3D printers aren't the end all and be all of creativity. We are also looking at expanding our portfolio into laser engravers. So we've got a host of laser engravers that'll mark anything, even color mark metal. Now the most exciting thing that we're showing off at CES, aside from the Spark X i7, is our Sermoon P1 laser scanner. Now this is exciting. This is super exciting, check this out. Just within a few seconds, our scanner will capture the entire world around you. And again, live here in front of everyone, we fully 3D scanned a car part. No smoke and mirrors, no magic, this isn't a placement. This is a live 3D scan that just so happens to be picked up within a few minutes on this all-in-one 3D scanner. Wow, that is amazing. Just look at the details. Now, normally you would think for something like this, because 3D scanners have been out for a while now. Yep. And we've seen this come, you know, these come from a number of companies that have some reputable names and some really high price points. Oh, so yeah. we're talking thousands of dollars sometimes for these mobile portable hand scanners. How much is something like that going for? So I mean, the P1 is still in development. It is a prototype, but I will tell you this. We've had very big institutions, so to speak. I can't name names, but they've come and asked us, hey, we know you're getting into 3D scanning. You know, we just spent $50,000 on our blue light and blue laser scanner. We see Creality's in that space, but you guys are a consumer 3D printer market, aren't you? And that's when we have to correct them, that yeah, we are in the consumer 3D printing space. And yes, our printers are a few hundred dollars. So they ask us, well, why are you selling $50,000 scanners? And that's when we correct them. Our scanners start at a few hundred dollars. One of our more advanced, what I like to call a people, places, and things from coins to car scanner is around $700. $700. The blue laser technology scanner that you saw here today, we're still looking for a price for it, but okay. it's younger brother that is tethered to a computer. Same technology, but not all in one, is $2,700. So from $50,000 technology, 
to an industrial grade metrology blue light laser scanner down to $27,2800. dollars that is fantastic. That's what Creality is known for, right? Yeah. And it's actually in a it's in a reachable point for not just professionals but consumers as well yeah. because no consumer is going to want to dish out $50,000 for a scanner. But every creator is going to want a scanner. You know, so this brings it closer to them, especially when you get to those price points like $700. That's true. Introductory price level is where Creality excels. We will take from 12 years ago when our four co-founders got together and said, hey, listen, I don't think a, a 3D printer should be $5,000. They got together, they brought the price down, they shattered the market, and they introduced leading technology for a few hundred dollars. And we have not strayed away from that vision whatsoever after over a decade of being firmly planted all over the world and in this unique industry. It's really nice to see this finally obtainable to the average Joe. And, but it's when we're talking about affordability, now the printer behind us as well, this was actually coming at an affordable price tag as well. You have the entire system. It's not just this with bare bones, the entire system. That's the CFS light, the four color capable uh, material unit, as well as the Spark XI7. You want to give me a price? You want to venture a guess? I Maybe? would say normally, uh, with everything going, like, because everybody's shooting for affordability now, yep. I would immediately say, okay, based on what I've seen from other companies, I'd shoot for about five to six to seven hundred dollars. Close. Four hundred bucks. Three ninety nine. Three ninety nine. So Bamboo Labs is out there somewhere, and their heart just went kind of down to their stomach. I mean. Don't get me wrong, nothing against Bamboo Labs. Oh, not at all, a fantastic but company. Over a decade in the industry, we're gonna make sure that you can get the best product for the best value. Absolutely, and now everybody can afford something like this. So for $400, you have a nice average print bed size, you have AI integration, you have a user-friendly interface that just works right out of the box, You know, so that means you're gonna have calibrations and everything built into it, which is, common we'd expect to see that with everything coming out today but also really easy to use interchangeable parts so that's what i did forget to mention so thank you so much for mentioning of course that. changing the nozzle every now and then accidents happen so you may have a clog you may have some material that maybe you shouldn't have put in or you just want to swap out a nozzle well you need well, a couple wrenches maybe some heat proof gloves yep you need to heat up the unit well guess what Pop that part off, undo this clip, and pull. Nozzles completely off. Perfect. No tools, no screws, no burns. All done within just a few seconds. And of course, since it's Creality, those replacement nozzles are going to be affordable. Of course. They're going to so, be super affordable. And that's perfect for people like me that are constantly switching between numbers. <laughs> just imagine being able to print a part half with a 0.6 millimeter nozzle and swapping out to do writing on it, to do designs on just the top to a 0.2 millimeter nozzle. The, the future is here. And with Creality, you're gonna get the future on your desk for affordable prices. And what we like to say with our Spark, and this is why we named it Spark, because every groundbreaking invention has always started with what? A Spark, right? It literally has. So we we say, powered by Creality, Get a spark and make something fire. And there you have it. And this is available right now. It is available. Actually, there are pre-orders. 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 It's coming into retail within just a couple weeks. I would say by mid-February. But if you act fast, you can have a pre-order from Creality, and it should ship within just about 45 days. So it is available it for is pre-order. Available. <laughs> so go to Creality's website to find out more about this. Not only of the printers, but their range, their, just their line of 3D scanners, as well as some of the other products that they have, including their, their laser machines that are phenomenal, as well as resin printing and everything else that the company makes. And again, like you said, it is a huge, huge, wide range of product. Of you know, so you're not just 3D printers anymore. You know, it's a go-to for everything if you're part of the maker world. So check them out at Creality's website, <laughs> as well as everywhere else where Creality is sold, which is everywhere for the most part. Everywhere. Amazon and everywhere else. Well, Duke, thank you so much. Thank this you so much. This has been fantastic. It's been fantastic. We, we cannot wait to see what comes next. We're super excited. 
We're super happy to speak to you. Big fans, thank you for being a Creality user. And uh, I guess we sign off like that. Sounds great. We'll right. see you next time. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.